Well, this was the sunrise starting to come up that we woke up to this morning. I don't think the colors on this video do it justice. And there's the Roxy dog. And there's Christina. And there's where our campers park. There's some lights moving around down there this morning. Might be the beach groomers. Not sure. Yeah. But there it is. So this morning we decided to take a stroll. This is the jetty. Pretty big jetty. It's on the canal here. And we've been sitting out over there, the other side of the red school bus, for what? Two days now? Yep. <laughs> And we hadn't like taken a, a yeah, and we hadn't taken a stroll over here. You see, these guys are out here in the morning with these uh, pretty good-sized canal. People fishing. There's the other side. There's a pop-up over there on that side. See it? People camp right here. People park really close to the ocean. He's not stubborn, maybe it's his owner. You are his owner, so you're probably right. It's funny because you can see where all the seaweed accumulates down here. We were just saying it looks like the sides are made out of huge pieces of really nice, kind of a pink colored granite. Boy, they must have used a lot of it. But if you have like a little uh, van camper or a uh, class B or B plus, you can pull the thing right down here um, into this corner we saw people camping here and you basically would be just about right on the ocean and I think even at high tide you won't have a problem here as long as you stay above that ridge yeah it's a little higher down here yeah. you want to see them fall? Oh, they're going to fly because they see Roxy <laughs> we were saying they look like miniature seagulls I don't know what kind of birds they are they're pretty small So, my lovely wife and I, and you are looking very lovely today, I might add. Thank you. I don't want to get make a shadow on your beautiful face. <laughs> no. But we were just saying how from out here our camper looks pretty small over there. Quite a ways out. What are we maybe? A little more than halfway out, maybe two-thirds of a way out. A lot of fishing going on down here. Well, we made it out here. This guy's pulling in a whopper. There's the end. In the Gulf of Mexico. And it's not windy today. I don't know if you can see these birds. They've been flying around this jetty in formation. Like Christina said, they're like the blue angels. Oh, they're going to go around that side of the jetty now. <laughs> oh, yeah, another group. Here they are. Look at those things. I don't know. Hopefully you can see them. There, oh, there, they changed direction. <laughs> That's so cool. The things you see when you get off the couch. That's right. <laughs> Are you going to let him go? <laughs> Turbo's acting like a nut. He's all excited because he's seen all these birds. Okay, let him go. See what they go. 
Roxy, make sure you take care of Turbo. Roxy, you pay attention. You're to the us. walker. You're the dog walker. You are the lead. All right. Uh oh, and they're off. Roxy. Yeah, he is. It's the happiest I've ever seen him. Freedom! Sorta. Sort of. As much freedom as you could give that dog. If you ever want to see him again. <laughs> Roxy, let's go over here! Time to change directions. He's like a, Come on, bring him back. He's going nuts. Bring him back. He's going nuts. He's chasing birds. Bring him back. Oh, now he's going to go in the water. Oh, oh boy. Geez. Don't drink it. No, no, no. Roxy, no. Come He'll up. get sick. He's peeing. <laughs> peeing in the ocean. Roxy. Roxy. Let him be no, dogs. I don't want her to drink the water. She's going to get sick. She puked last time. Roxanne, don't drink the water. You're okay. They're just being dogs. They're on vacation too, you know. <laughs> of course I'll pick it up. Yeah, of course. Oh, they're going for a regular swim. That water's freezing. Stop Yeah, any time that you can ride your motorcycle along the beach like this at uh, well, almost the end of January, I'd say that's pretty cool. I know I'm enjoying it. No helmet law here. If you crashed on the beach, I guess what are you going to do, fall in the soft sand? So, been wearing a helmet when we're on the street. But definitely don't see a need for it when I'm going uh, 10 miles an hour on the beach. You're more apt to skin your knee than anything. That'd be about it. <laughs> probably, uh, probably bruise your uh, ego, your pride more than you would anything if that happened. I did just almost uh, dump it over there in the real soft sand. So I decided to um, go here where you're closer. When you get this close, <laughs> the sand is practically like concrete. And these big hotels right out in the water here. Pretty nice spot here on Padre Island. Ooh, look at that hole. And all this time, it was only four miles from where we were staying. We thought it was 400 miles. But it took us three days to get here. <laughs> That's all right. That's all right. We were exploring other areas. That's right. Look at this. It is flat. Nice old schoolie. <laughs> nice solar setup. Thank you. <laughs> wow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'd like Slice to stop and light. talk to that lady. Want to pull over? Sure. Rusty bucket. 
The trusty the bucket. The trusty bucket. It's on Facebook. And what's your name? It has about 1,100 followers. My name is Teresa. Cool. You got a lot more than us. Nice I'm Doug and this you. is Christina. <laughs> nice Hi, to meet Christina. you. And nice on YouTube, you. we're Happy Wanderers. This is Winston and that's Gonzo. Gonzo. Hey, guys. It's like Gonzo. So, I know, some right? people would be scared to death of you guys running it's after them like you were, but right? they look friendly. Yeah, they are. <laughs> Hey, 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 quit slobbering. Okay. <laughs> we just didn't get back here, come on. They're wired for sound, so. Wow. So how much solar do you have on this thing? 2,300 watts. Wow. Power. My YouTube channel is Jogata, J-O-G-O-T-T-A. But I have 2,300 watts. Each of those panels is um, 285 watts. Wow. I have um, 16 Trojan T105 um, deep cycle. Yep. Um, batteries yep. um, for 450 amp hours. Wow. I have a PT, a Magnum PT100 um, charge controller. Uh huh. That's 48 volts. Okay. And it, it charges, the batteries are set up eight on a series, so it's. So here we are, we made it down, further down on the National Seashore, Padre Island, National Seashore. We could sit in the sand if you wanted to, it might be a little high. We were just gonna have a little picnic here. My wife packed us a picnic in the cooler. It's more like a table chair. Yeah, it's gonna be more of a table. It's up to you. You wanna sit in the sand or we can stand here and have a little feast. Oceanside. I might take that blanket and take my nap over in the dunes where they said the rattlesnakes are. <laughs> did you enjoy your lunch, Mrs. Mitchell? I did. It was very, very relaxing. It was very nice. It was. It was a very special moment that we chose not to share with you two. <laughs> We can't show you guys everything. <laughs> no hanky panky happened. <laughs> uh, always a disclaimer. <laughs>Christina, so where are we today? We are in Rudy's. Rudy's is... What is Rudy's? Well, <laughs> Rudy's is a very small store, as you can see. Yes. Drinks. Yep. Uh, a few snacks, souvenirs, and then the rest is a barbecue... Restaurant. Very cool place. Very neat. So we're gonna have to try a piece of brisket or something. Okay, so what do you wanna get? Show them, show them what they got. They got a little bit of everything when it comes to barbecue. They have the, uh, Dr. Pepper on tap. Fountain soda. All right, so Rudy's is the friendliest employees I think I've ever seen in my life. Do you have, oh I have cards. Look at this, that's half of a smoked potato. Smoked baked, baked potato. potato. Look at the size of it. That's the other half. That's one baked potato right there. That's 
ten dollars worth of food with a drink. And that is like the best. What they call it? Spicy. It's almost like a uh, sp spicy mix. No, spicy. Shoot. I think I just threw the receipt away. I'm trying to remember. It's and it's a gas station. <laughs> Looks pretty good. For sure. So they give you these round papers. <laughs> yeah, is, that's your plate. It's, it's really kind of cool. This yeah, is it is. Mat. Yep. And they they put it in this thing. It's this a Coca Cola tray. tray. And you basically like put all your junk in here. <laughs> it really is a Coca Cola tray. And then you throw it away. Not the tray, but everything in it. Yeah. Take a guess of which one Doug had and which one I had. We're not <laughs> telling. So, tell me about your snack. My yeah. snack? That mm -hmm. was quite a snack. I won't be looking at for any dinner. That was so much of a snack. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we had the half of kind of a loaded baked potato. Huh? It was huge. It was very good. Yeah, there's a, there's a quarter of a half. It's like a shredded barbecue, like a pork type thing. Mm -hmm. Really good. So the Almost good. reminded me of burnt ends. It's not mm -hmm. the real smoky flavor. Kind of very good. Crispy a little bit. Mm -hmm. Really good. But one thing that impressed me is the cute little young lady behind the counter. <laughs> and the they, very handsome gentleman that helped us at the okay. door. Well, they explained how this place works and their food offerings. They gave us samples of anything we wanted. And we only ordered like $10.26 worth of food. And it was like this place just rolled out the red carpet and made you feel like a VIP. And uh, they would have gave us all the samples we wanted. Mm -hmm. And super, super friendly. And just, I just keep saying, you know, we'd always heard about Southern hospitality, <clears throat> but there really is such a thing as Southern hospitality. And we found it all kinds of businesses. Mm -hmm. so, people don't rush you when you're asking questions. They, people are polite when they're waiting. Polite. They don't blow horns at yep. you in traffic. Yep. They don't see people flipping you off. Yep. Absolutely. <laughs> no, it's totally different. At least not so far we haven't. I mean, so. I'm sure it happens, but... Yeah. But we haven't as, witnessed it. Yeah, it's something common. It's not common down here versus... We find that there are definitely areas that we've been to that it is very common. <laughs> We've really been impressed with Texas. Absolutely. God bless right. Texas. <laughs> so Rudy's Country Store and barbecue and there's the cup. Great environment too. It's very garagey like <laughs> I don't know how to describe it. Nothing like garagey. But see they have these big garage doors that can be closed. Very cool. Alright. Thanks Rudy. So we stopped into this gift shop, and there's a reason why people stop here. They spent some serious money on the front of this place. Oh, the wind! Sorry folks, I gotta get something for this wind. I don't use half the shots I've been taking here because of the wind. Right, Tom? Yeah. Yeah. Success. Yeah. 
higher up. So if you're enjoying the videos, folks, please like, share, but most importantly, subscribe. You'd be amazed what you'll see if you get off the couch. Have a great day.